Your Natchez History Minute is brought to you by Natchez National Historical Park. The Grand Village of the Natchez Indians Mound Site and Museum that is operated by the Mississippi Department of Archives and History was formally dedicated and opened to the public on September 1, 1976. Initially labeled as the Fatherland Plantation Site, a 1930 Mississippi Department of Archives and History excavation led by Morrow Chambers helped to establish the site as the ceremonial center of the Nachi people that was richly documented by French colonists in the early 18th century. An additional excavation was led by Robert Neitzel in 1962. Due to growing concerns of encroaching land development, local preservationist Grace McNeil made an initial donation in 1971 of more than 35 acres to the Mississippi Department of Archives and History. Everett truly spearheaded local efforts to acquire more land for the department, expanding the site to 128 acres. Mississippi Department of Archives and History Director Elbert Hilliard led the development of the site as a public attraction following a 1972 excavation again led by Robert Neitzel. Local politicians such as House Speaker John Junkin, Senate President Pro Tem Marion Smith, and Representative Walter Brown were instrumental in securing funding for the site development project. This important historic site has served to preserve and interpret one of the last utilized mound centers of North America for the past 40 years and provides an exciting array of educational opportunities to both children and adults. Hello, I am Janice Sega, gift shop manager with the Grand Village of the Natchez Indians, and this has been your Natchez History Minute.